Hello, the Thief has it. How's it going? Today's video is just a fun little fact video. While researching a theory I'm doing at the moment, I came across what I believe the meaning behind the names of the brand new trial captains are. And I figured rather than make my theory super long, I'd just give you this fun little fact video. Get ready to learn. Starting with Mallow, Mallow's name can come from two places really. Either she has some kind of link to Ireland, because over there it's an Irish girl's name and has lots to do with the river Aloe, there's also a town called Mallow there, but secondly, and most likely, it's to do with flowers. Now, I don't know if you've heard, but a lot of names in the recent games have been to do with flowers, like Lily is one that comes to mind straight away, and Lysander, his name is Fleur de Lys in the Japanese version, and that is Lily as well, and tons and tons of other people have all had like you know flower related names plus she's a grass type trainer which you know again links to flowers so the mallow or malva family of plants contains a lot of different species of uh, flowers but most notably it contains the hibiscus flowers which for those of you who don't know is the state flower of hawaii that's why i believe the hibiscus flower or the family of flowers in which hibiscus is part of is where she gets her name from next we'll go with lana lana's name can also come from a few places it could be based off some traditional hawaiian porches and architecture the island of lanai which is uh, one of the islands of hawaii or again flowers as it's a kind of orchid or it means orchid but the one i think is most likely is in hawaii the name lana actually means a float or calm waters which her being a water type trainer you know makes me think that that's probably where it comes from third is sophocles this greek guy kaiwi or however you say his name I'm about 99% certain I know where his name comes from, and I believe that to be the Prosopis pallida plant. This is a kind of tree that is native to South Africa, but was brought to Hawaii where it became an invasive species. But what's really, really interesting about this plant is it makes exceptional firewood, and that's why the people of Hawaii aren't particularly bothered by the fact, you know, they have this invasive, this invasive species of plant because they just cut it down to make barbecues and stuff. And him being a fire type trainer, I think. It's almost 100% certain that his name would be based off this, you know, this incredible firewood. Just gonna go back to Sophocles. I don't know if he's actually based off this Greek guy, but because all the other three have links to plants, I would hazard a guess to say there might be a Sophocles plant or something related to him, but I just couldn't find it because of all my search results being just drowned out by, you know, English students and people talking about his plays and his life and stuff. He is too famous and completely just drowned out all my other searches, I think. So if anyone does know of any Sophocles related plants or any other meaning behind the name Sophocles, please feel free to leave it in the comments below. Keep an eye out for my theory, which will be coming soon. I'm pushing it back a tiny bit. I was going to release it just after this one, but probably not because I think it needs a bit more work. Please like, subscribe, and comment. I want to know what you think about all this. Please tell me how you feel about the trial captains. Personally, I quite like the idea of this change, but if we don't have gyms, that's going to upset a lot of people. Tell me if you're one of those people. Also, I have a 100 subscriber Q&A coming up, some point in time. So if you have any questions you'd like to ask me, please leave them in the comments too. And uh, yeah, with that said, we're out.